All right, everybody, I have a treat for you guys. I got the Blackberry Playbook. Uh, as you know, everybody's been reviewing this. Uh, so far, I've got to give it some time. I like the finish it has it in the back. Makes it easier to hold. Um, it's got the button up here for the power and on and off. It is a little bit on the downside is that it is flush and it's hard to turn on and off. So what I do is, since it's on sleep mode, what you can do is you just slide your finger over from the side and, um, oops, this, <laughs> that's normally wakes it up. Oh, there it goes. I don't know. There was some kind of delay, I guess. Let's try that again. See if when it's off, you slide it over and it wakes it up just like that. But I got a treat for you guys. Uh, <clears throat> I want to show you the the BlackBerry. Um, as you can see on the screen, uh, let's see if I can zoom in a little bit on there. Uh, as you can see, my mouse pointer there. Um, you can go ahead and connect a Bluetooth uh, item on here. Right, so I'll double click the browser, and you're able to browse around let me click on Amazon as you can see it's opening it and if I want to go ahead and click uh, a website I go ahead and bring up my Bluetooth keyboard and I can type in msn.com and enter and I pretty much have a full little computer here <clears throat> with a great browser this is the best browser on a mobile device or tablet so far that I've used. It's very close to uh, my desktop uh, experience on it. And if I go here on the corner, which I've been using, is uh, I go ahead and take out the top. And, uh, and now I have a full browser, or not a full browser, but a full screen. If I want to go ahead and retap uh, address bar, I just slide my finger up here and then I'll bring that back down. Um, but let me go show you uh, actually or let me show you like let's uh, I'll click on this one as you can see I can even scroll with the mouse you can see it's scrolling it's working really nice this is really 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 good um, let me see uh, we can go back to the back here that takes it back you can type in whatever you want in a search um, I can type it on my keyboard. Uh, I just put news, enter. See how quickly it is. It's uh, it's work works really really nice. Let me go ahead and um, show you. Let's say you have your your keyboard here. I haven't got a case for this, but uh, I think I'm gonna pick up a case like uh, the Galaxy Tab that. You know, I could kind of use it like a stand and case at the same time, so that way I could be able to kind of hold it like this and use my keyboard as well. But uh, I'm also using the Bluetooth mouse here. And let's see, um, I'll show you. Let, let me open up, um, or actually, let me go to show you a Word document. As you can see, I'll just click new, loading, and let me see, I'll make a bold, I'm going to tally path. This is a test using the, oh, I was going to put Galaxy Tab, no, just kidding. Uh, duck, um, using the, Let me misspell something. Oops. Let's see what it. It also, as you can see, it catches uh, misspelled words to go for documents. So that's pretty nice, and um, you can scroll around as as well and see if you can highlight it if you wanted to select text. In this case, I was I say I was highlighting just this part with the mouse. Um, 
So it's uh, working pretty nice with the Bluetooth keyboard and, and mouse. So anybody want to try it, can, um, I'll do copy and then let's go down here and uh, paste it. And there you go. Exactly what I highlighted. It was able to paste it on the bottom line where I chose to paste. So it's uh, freaking really nice. So that's the good treat for you guys. So get your Bluetooth keyboards and a mouse and you can have a little computer on the road. Make it easier to surf or navigate through your web browser. As you can see I'm just scrolling with my mouse. Alright, thanks for watching and uh, see you later.